Hey guys, Joshua here, and welcome to, to, to some bad, and welcome, and welcome to bad news, or whatever. Anyway, anyway, my friend Quincy, my friend Quincy, just, just, just let me go to his channel. My friend Quincy, I'm just gonna go. Wait, I'm just gonna go to his channel. Okay, where is he? So anyway, on. I said with Quincy, Quincy has has this pink eye, and just let me and just and just let me go on these messages, and it says, or so like it says. I'm checking the messages right now. What Quincy says, and he said, "My secret is that that somehow I feel like a robot with bright blue eyes and running and other things in PE, and I also betrayed my ex ex wife or ex ex wife." Sorry, or sorry, Quincy, I said that. Ex girlfriend. Um. Ex girlfriend. For flaming my BFFs. Last thing is that I have been working with all. Of my people that I know, including Josh. Well, okay. And so, in case you guys don't don't know what pink eye is, well, I or well, I know or well, I know some of you guys. Or well, I know you guys know what pink eye is. In case if you've forgotten. I'm just going to type, type it in and, and tell you, and I'm just going to use the text, text speech reader. Pink eye conjunctivitis overview. Not here. Pink eye. <laughs> Whoop. Pink eye is most often caused by a viral infection. It also can be caused by a bacterial infection and alert. Hold on a second. Hold on. Print. No. Overview. That works. Pink eye conjunctivitis. He's right here. Pink eye is an inflammation of the transparent membrane that lines the eyelid and eyeball. Oh this God. membrane is called the conjunctiva. When small blood vessels in the conjunctiva become swollen and irritated, they're more visible. This is what causes the whites of the eyes to appear reddish or pink. Wow. Pink eye also is called conjunctivitis. He just said that. Pink eye is most often caused by a viral infection. It also can be caused by a bacterial infection, an allergic reaction, or, in babies, an incompletely open tear duct. Though pink eye can be irritating, it rarely affects your vision. Treatments can help ease the discomfort of pink eye. Because pink eye can be contagious, getting an early diagnosis and taking certain precautions can help limit its spread. Um, okay. Let's see what this one is. When to see a doctor. There are serious eye conditions that can cause eye redness. These conditions may cause eye pain, a feeling that something is stuck in your eye, blurred vision, and light sensitivity. If you experience these symptoms, seek urgent care. People who wear contact lenses need to stop wearing their contacts as soon as pink eye symptoms begin. If your symptoms don't start to get better within 12 to 24 hours, make an appointment with your eye doctor to make sure you don't have a more serious eye infection related to contact lens use. Whew. Okay, let, let's see. Causes. 
Causes of pink eye include viruses, bacteria, allergies, a chemical splash in the eye, a foreign object in the eye. Wow. In newborns, a blocked tear duct. Viral and bacterial conjunctivitis. Jeez, Most cases of pink eye are caused by adenovirus, but also can be caused by other viruses, including herpes simplex virus and varicella zoster virus. Both viral and bacterial conjunctivitis can occur along with colds or symptoms of a respiratory infection, such as a sore throat. Wearing contact lenses that aren't cleaned properly or aren't your own can cause bacterial conjunctivitis. Wow. Is that it? More? Allergic conjunctivitis. Okay, this is the last Allergic one. Allergic conjunctivitis affects both eyes and is a response to an allergy-causing substance such as pollen. In response to allergens, your body produces an antibody called immunoglobulin E, EGA. EGA triggers special cells in the mucus lining of your eyes and airways to release inflammatory substances, including histamines. Your body's release of histamine can produce a number of allergy symptoms, including red or pink eyes. If you have allergic conjunctivitis, you may experience intense itching, tearing and inflammation of the eyes, as well as sneezing and watery nasal discharge. Most allergic conjunctivitis can be controlled with allergy eye drops. Allergic conjunctivitis is not contagious. Okay, that that is enough rating for today. I... I'm not zooming that in. <laughs> I'm not zooming that in. It's just going to be way too creepy. Okay, guys. That is everything that I just want to do. So, so anyway, I'm just, I'm just going to go in this video here. So, anyway, if you like this video, please subscribe. And I will see you guys in the, in, in the next video. Yeah. Anyway. Bye, guys.